Hello. Today's letter comes to us from L, who writes, Dear Brother Ron, is life all about God testing us, seeing whether or not we truly love him? My question is, there are thousands of terrible things happening at this second, and I wanted to know if God purposely does this so that he doesn't repeat the mistake he made when he created Satan. Thus, basically, I have come to believe, and I don't imply this as an insult, that when God created humanity, he was somewhat inexperienced, and that God is somewhat human. I believe that he is human because the very fabric of this universe was created from his very soul. And if God created everything, that must mean that he put his love into his creation. Thus, I have come to believe that he is somewhat human. Last but not least, scientists have theorized that there is more than one universe. They call it a multiverse. Thus, I have theorized that heaven, hell, and earth were created after the universe of heaven was established. So many questions, yet are there any answers? Well, dear L, first of all, let me tell you where you are correct. You are correct when you say that the universe was created from the fabric of God's soul. You are also correct when you say that the love of God is present in every part of his creation. Finally, you are correct when you say that what we call the universe is only one of an infinite number of possible universes. You are incorrect, however, in several areas. First of all, Satan was not a mistake. Many people believe Satan was created by the church to represent the embodiment of worldly temptation. If such a creature exists as a distinct phenomenon, he and his work are part of God's plan to help us develop into beings who will eventually grow beyond these worldly temptations to the spiritual beings we are intended to become. Second, you say that the fact that God's love exists in his creations shows his humanity. I believe you have it backwards. The fact that humans are able to recognize the presence of God's love within us shows the close relationship we are able to establish with our Father. Family resemblances are passed down from parent to child, not from child to parent. And third, your question about God testing us implies there is a question God does not yet have the answer for. This would mean that God's knowledge and wisdom are not perfect, and he is therefore not perfect and isn't really God. Obviously, you underestimate him. God is neither human nor inexperienced. We humans are the mere infants aspiring to grow, to grow closer to the perfect Godhead from which the universe emanated. Personally, I can't wait to see what I become when I grow up. Thank you for joining us.